Wanneer jy jou product uit die Delo reeks kies, het jy jou vernoot wat jou eindtijd bystaan. Delo, saam gaan ons verder. Elke week in betrekking en bespreek ons sake wat te maak het met die werkplek. Verdere opleiding is dikwels een sleutel tot vordering en vooruitgang in een loopbaan. Die Universiteit van Pretoria se Gordon Institute of Business Science, of soos ek vroeger gesê Gibbs, is onlangs bekroon as die beste sakeskool in Suid-Afrika en inderdaad Afrika. Ons gesels vandag met hulle directeur Jonathan Cook oor hoe hier die school en ook ander sakeskole werknemers in die sakewereld kan bemachtig. Good morning Jonathan. Good morning Hulk. Please elaborate on this this huge honor for Gibbs. Thank you. Well, we, we are very chuffed. It's not the first time, actually, but um, uh, this is, a, a, I think, acknowledgement of, of great staff, great students, and, and, we, and we are very pleased. It means a lot to us because it indicates that here in the bottom of Africa, there are schools that do rank with the best in the world. And this was done by the UK Financial Times? The, the FT, indeed, yes. Um, uh, when they, what is... Explain the ranking system mm. to me. Okay. Well, the FT have two main sets of rankings. One is for the MBA, uh, mm -hmm. and the other is this one, which is for executive education. And these are, 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 are for short courses, mostly. Some of them are, quite, are, are longer, but mostly shorter courses for people who are in management positions in companies. And it has two parts to it. One is for uh, programs that individuals attend. Um, and the other one is for custom programs that we create f with companies, for companies, for their managers. Mm -hmm. And each of those is, is, is ranked and then the scores are combined. And they do bring out surveys to um, our, our partners and our participants, asking questions like, you know, could you use material, quality of the, of the faculty, quality of the facilities, would you come back again, those kind of questions. Then they ask us questions like, you know, describe your faculty to us and your facilities mm -hmm. and so on. You mentioned earlier that you work with companies. Mm. Um, what exactly do you do? Well, we have about 50 companies that during the course of the year will work with them to design programs that are custom, customized for their programs. So they might send 20, 30 or 40 people to us for a short term or a longer time and we create things that will cover the topics uh, that they need to be strategic in developing the work that uh, they have to do. In their business. In their business, exactly. They most often come to us, but we might go to their facilities, particularly if they're not in uh, Santon or, 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 or the Joburg area. Yeah. And in fact, last year we ran programs or took students to 26 different countries around the world. That's a lot. That is. <laughs> Um, now these are students that are part of companies, are you and individual students? Yes, individuals. Well, we, um, they will send individuals to us for, for courses that we call open uh, enrollment courses. Yes. And then the custom uh, courses would be for a group of managers in that company, just for that company. Um, uh, how can further in education empower uh, individuals? Mm. Does it, does it, is it a life-changing thing for them to go and study further? I mean, most of them w w go and do MBAs at Gibbs, am I right? Well, they are, indeed, we have about 250 a year we take into the MBA, and we have a, something called the Postgraduate Diploma in Business Administration, a great course for those who have less experience because we require at least five years' experience for the MBA. Mm -hmm. And we've got something called the PMD, which is a, a certificate program, less demanding than the PDB. Uh, but also a great program. So those are programs that individuals will come on. Then we have these uh, short courses, executive programs, which might be three or four days or mm -hmm. up to a month. And then we have the custom programs. So for the open enrollment programs and courses like the MBA, individuals will sign up. And they are, they are, they are life changing. I just hear that again and again and mm -hmm. again. People come in and are changed often in unexpected ways. Mm -hmm. uh, they arrive with highly motivated, highly committed because, you know, it's, it's a big call on your on your life to do something like the MBA. Yes. Yeah. And we expose them to things that they, they didn't realize were there. Uh, often things out in society, you know, how does South Africa work? Who are the South Africans that you have to manage and, and sell your, your, your products to, etc.? And what's exciting to us is in addition to, be, to having their business skills honed, which obviously they're there for, they also become um, citizens uh, who are committed to, to the future of the country. They, they find, because the class is so diverse, they, mm. they discover fellow South Africans that they can be enthusiastic about, enthusiastic with, to making a difference in society. It's a costly thing. It's, mm. It takes time, mm. especially if you're, if you're working, you've got yeah. a family. Um, does it really help people to get ahead? I think it does. You know, we, we survey our alumni every year, and uh, one of the ways to measure progress is through salary increases. Well, that, mm. it's, a, it's, it's not an ideal measure because sometimes people will go into, let's say, a, a, 
a non-profit where they might be paid as, paid as much, but they have a huge impact. But there's a significant increase in the average salary, and we, and we notice people being promoted very often during the MBA if they haven't gone full time. Let's see uh, if they're in the part-time program. Um, so there is there is kind of objective measure of progress mm. during the course, uh, but there's also progress in themselves and in their confidence. Uh, and an ability to run successful businesses. Quite a few, in fact, go out and start their own businesses yes. or, or work together to create a new business. Yes, you're talking about entrepreneurship. Mm. Um, now, there is a difference between a ranking, your ranking first uh, voted by the UK Financial Times, mm. and then accreditation. Right. Accreditation is when uh, the accrediting body uh, examines the uh, whole wadge of documents that you prepare for them and they send out a panel for mm. two days and they grill you and have a look at what you have and uh, are able to certify that what we offer is of a quality um, and, uh, and that it meets international standards. We of mm. course are accredited with the local South African authorities and we have an international accreditation called AMBA, which is the Association of MBAs, which is a UK based, mm. one of the three international um, bodies that uh, does this for, for business schools. Jonathan, thank you very much. Thank nice you. talking to you. This is Jonathan Cook, the Rateer van Gibbs. Hier die weken op jou merke bied ons Pilates oefeninge vir swanger vrouwe aan. Ek wil daarom ook net sê, jy hoef nou nie swanger te wees om hierby baat te vind nie, en selfs mans kan het ook doen. Goeiemorgen, ek is net, en dit is my vriendin Sjaal. Ons werk is En ons gaan vandag vir julle twee oefeninge wees. Hierdie is baie goed vir um, swanger dames, maar gewone mense kan dit ook gebruik. Die eerste oefening wat ons julle gaan wees, is a chest strength net oefening. Ok, met hierdie ene gaan jy weer op een bal sit. As jy nie een bal het by die huis nie, kan jy een stoel ook gebruik. Onthou, wanneer jy hierdie oefening doen, wil jy jou rug mooi raag uithaal, en jy gaan nie te ver achter op die bal sit, of te ver voor op die bal nie. Jy gaan jy bene in die 90 grade hou, en jy gaan jy voete in die gemakkelijke positie hou, en onthou om jy voete voor en toe te laat wees. Ok, met hierdie oefening gaan jy een tere band gebruik, of een raak. Jy gaan hem oor jou skoot laat lewe, en dan van daarop gaan jy jou arms kruis, soos Michelle hier so doen. Dan gaan jy net die, bal, die band optaal, En daar nie jou arms hoor as jy skouwers op dit taal nie en jy gebrugte gaan nie jy altyd recht uit blij. Jy skouwers gaan afwijs en jy gaan jou nek leen 